We are. Hi. It's happy birthday to my daughter. Happy birthday, daughter. Uh, <laughs> she's hiding. Anyway, so uh, you speak too. Wow. Okay, so it's been a while and we apologize, but it's just, you know, sometimes hard to get around to doing this because of everything that goes on. So, yeah. Um, you know, you've kind of come along with us on this journey and uh, it's, it's difficult. And I don't know if you have been able to put yourself in our position and how you might react or feel or anything like that. Um, but it just, it really, really wears you down. And then, especially when it feels like nothing goes right, like it, like everything is just, just going wrong. Um, so it's easy to just whine and complain. And I can't tell you how many times that just, I had to fight tears because the situation just it seems hopeless. The longer it goes on, the more hopeless it seems. But, um, I met with a, a friend and this is long overdue and I apologize. And, um, I got a card from them. Let's just, it was a blessing. They gave us a gift and, um, from several of the band parents. And so we owe you a, a great big thank you. Um, you know who you are. I'll, I'm not going to say who all joined in on this, but, and it just made me think that even though we are positive people and we tend to see the glasses half full as opposed to half empty again it's just you know after being in the situation for so many days or weeks and whatever it's just hard to keep facing each day to keep hope alive um but i realized that um that we weren't as grateful as we could have been that we um even when we're just staying in the motorhome, okay, granted, a lot of things don't work in it, but we saw some people in tents out at the campground. And on the nights when it got really cold and really windy, you know, we were better off than those people in the tents. And now we're in a hotel, which um, is more costly than the, the campground, but we have hot, hot water. We have, um, you know, regular TV, not that we need to watch that, just no. turns us into boobs. But, you know, we just, two big beds and we're level and, you know, I, so. A little I told, mini fridge. A little mini fridge that works all the time. So I just told the kids that, you know, we just, we really need to just be thankful for whatever it is we have. And instead of just complaining because we're not in our own place right now, just be grateful that we have um, what we have. It's, it's not ideal. It's not the best, but you know, it could be worse. So yay. You know, we might be in the hotel for Christmas. We got each other. We got these crazy cats. One that won't shut oh up my anymore. Gosh, this thing. Of course he's like 15 years old and it's just constantly throughout the night. I'm oh, shut up for us. Shut up for us. But, um, yes. So that's, um, I think that's a lot of what's been going on. Um, what else did we say we were going to say? You, your goofy knee. I hurt myself. <laughs> yeah, and it still hurts. I hurt it pretty bad. It's not the first time my knee has popped out sideways. Um, and it wasn't even that long ago that the last time that I did it. Well, this time was a doozy. Swelled up nice and big. Can't hardly move it. You should see me trying to get around the first few days. <laughs> <laughs> it was pitiful. <laughs> You're still kind of pitiful. Yeah, well, at least I have crutches now. Um, so there's that. Um, I don't know what. Mm. It seems like there was something else. It kind of does, but I don't remember. I don't know either. Well, um, anyway, um, we're grateful for you. If um, I'm hoping we'll we'll get back to do a special Christmas message for everybody but if not Merry Christmas and I hope that um, you guys have half the love and joy that my kids and I share because if that determined how wealthy a person was we'd be the richest people in the world no lie you can't tell it by his mug though <sighs> just well you're just sitting there talking talking what do you want me to say well I don't know 
interrupt or something. Most kids interrupt their parents. I'm not most kids. Obviously. You should know that by now. Well, convince them that you're happy, that we're joyful, and, you know, we're, <laughs> we're, we're rich in, in this way. So, all right. I try, you know, I don't know. I try to get him to speak, but, you know, I don't know what to do. Maybe hold a truffle out in front of him or something. <laughs> All right. Well, is there anything else? I don't think so. Okay, well, until next time. Bye. Thank you again for um, all you who helped out. Thank you so very much. God bless you. Peace, love, and hippie beats. Bye.